What is up, guys and girls? I am Virtual Pix, and welcome back to In It's the Rift. Oh, it's nice to be here again. Now, the, the, I'm probably going to end up doing another one of these recordings later today, um, where I'll actually have my crew back if they stop playing the other game. Yeah, you heard me. That's if he even still watches. Which I would guess he probably does. Since he always seems to know the bloody hell I'm up to in this. Right. What have we got? Uh, ooh. I like it that. Ship. Come here, ship. I need you. There we go. Um, Hydroplex needs goods. Mission details and accept. Because I figured if I'm actually going to even start making a dent in the amount of. Oh shit, that's too long. Yeah, if I'm even going to start making a dent into the amount of materials that I need for. Um, wow, I can't even afford that, seriously. Holy shit. The amount of resources I need for the other ship. I will eventually finish this. What I'm saying. Eventually. Yes, I know it's only got a small one. It's fine. Oh, then I'm going to need to start working up some money to work off my debt. To also get money to basically just buy if I don't want to be standing around for a million bazillion years just mining things. It makes me wonder how long it's going to take me and Cyber to actually get enough materials to build a bloody space station like his plan is. Especially when he's never fucking on so it's mostly me. But it's fine. I don't mind. God damn it, you would be the other side of the fucking planet, wouldn't you? Whoa! And two, one, away! Slow down. Uh, we've got what, like 16 seconds till we get there, so screw it. You know what? We're just gonna stay in this warp and I'm just gonna do my thing and let my brain just spill out endless amounts of bullshit. Because that's pretty much what my commentary is. Oh, please tell me that was a perfect. Oh. It was an almost perfect drop. You know, considering how quick that came up, I am um, impressed. And we got another 10 seconds. Another little 10 second jump at uh, absolute minimum whoop. And. Boop. I don't like the fact that I saw an alien signature there. That's kind of concerning. You know, we're going to get nice and close, and I'm just going to let the ship float in at this point. Because I know the ship stopped. Especially since I can't hear my 15 engines anymore. Uh, Hydroplex Depot, because to be honest, I want to get in and out of this station with that alien signature. Because I think that signature was actually the marker for a warp dampening screw. And this is aside from the fact that I don't really want egg knights on my ship again, thanks. Because it's a bitch to get rid of. Because I have to fly all the way to a station that can repair it. And then just. It's, it's, it's bollocks, basically. Um, get out of my way. Uh, we've got cargo transfer. Supplies needed for expansion. 
Ooh. Surprisingly, how much are you? Four six and four zeros. And you're... Yeah, so you're worth infinitely more. Give me! Thank you! Wait. Did that... Did that just dump a shit ton of iron onto my ship? Because, oh boy, if that dumped a, sh a shit ton of iron onto my ship, then I'm... Either going to be one very, very happy, but slightly sad at the same time because that will weight the ship down. Which means it, it can't run away as fast. Ugh. Did I dump a load of iron onto my ship? No, nothing down there. The fuck? Wait, what? Give me my goddamn messages. What the fuck is this? Uh, Spider need you for expansion. Open message. Oh, you need 20,000 to be delivered. Oh. Oh, I should have read that. Oh no, that's actually a pretty decent dent. Um, I don't have enough to get 20,000, I'd have to mine that. I mean, mining it wouldn't actually be all that difficult. Where we even use the station? Okay, so it's over, it's the Hydroplex one again. Do you know what? Screw it. I... I cannot be... I've got to get enough bloody iron for myself. The last thing I need is for you to be... Yes, I know. Whatever. Go on, how much? Uh, it's probably added a decent amount. To chunk to my deck. Fick. That's fine. I'll work it off. It's not, not even a big deal. I do, however, want to go to this weapon platform. Which I'll get to in just a second. And again. There we go. See, I don't mind being around an S3 weapon production plant because I know for a fact that this has drones. In fact, it's actually got a number of drones around it. So yeah, well, we're gonna go and have a little hokey poke at this. See if there's anything decent here left behind. I'm going to loot and scavenge it, like the pirate I am. Because I might be working for HSC, but at heart, I'm the old pirate from the seven galaxies. Don't ask, that, that was entirely on the fly. My brain doesn't do well when I have to word on the fly. Avast, my mates! You're getting raided. This is if I haven't already raided you, which I think I may have. Yeah. Yeah, pretty convinced that I may have actually already raided this place. It's looking um, quite spare, sparse. Uh, denied. Oh yeah, that's to the fucking thing, Madougal. Actually, you know, let's go and have a take a little peek as to what they got in there, shall we? Eventually. Eventually. Uh, right, so it's this door here we want, I think. Uh, you got a missile, you got some... Do you know, if I had the ability to hack this place, um... 
actually raid this. I'd say that at this moment in time, this would almost be worth it. Actually, considering that there's like two defense drones and two missiles and a bunch of night. Is that uh, nitrogen? I think it's nitrogen. That would actually be a, a pretty decent pull from the station. But alas, that is not the case. Now, yeah, th this has most definitely been raided. Probably by me and Cyber. Knowing us. Now, don't you have a bloody... Yeah, here we go. Um, expanding the sphere of influence. Is this a delivery one again? Uh, so we need your help with a shipment of the standard ammo which needs to be delivered to this system. Uh, we have plans to build several new defense points in order to make the system a safer place. Your compliance is much appreciated. Ooh, hey, defense drones. Give to me! Now, I'm hoping that it doesn't actually require me to fly to it. I think if it's in white, you don't. It is actually in system, and if it's. If I'm correct, if it's yellow, in like a yellowy colour, that means it's in an external system. I think. Don't quote me on this because I actually don't 100% know. Can we not? Can I, I? I want to just fucking beam me back aboard my ship. Beam me up, Scotty. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Invisible Scotty. Now, if you don't quite mind, can we get these hunger bolts moving? Alright, where the fuck are we going? We are... Yeah, there we go. It is in system. Lovely. Uh, I would greatly appreciate... Ooh, it's a supply outpost as well. Uh, it's not even actually that far away. Um, yeah, we're not taking 29 minutes to get there. I mean... As much as my brain can spill endless amounts of bullshit out for commentary, I highly doubt that people are going to want to watch me for 29 minutes while I fly to a place when I can get there much fucking quicker. Speaking of which... Vic. Hey, we'll be shot it. It's fine. We got this. We've only got like five seconds of me being a doof. And uh, uh, hopefully this place actually has defense drones. Please tell me you have defense drones. That would be also nice if you did. God damn! Why are you so far away? Oh, you said like one second before I, I dropped completely within. But you know what, this is taking a long time. <laughs> okay, very, very nearly walked into the station there. That would have um, been disastrous. I wonder if there's ever like, ha like programs like. Star Trek, it'd be fucking amazing, like, it would be really interesting if, like, someone actually managed to walk a starship into a space station, because even though that would be disastrous, at the same time, that would actually be kind of impressive, because actually walking a starship into a space station would be no easy task. Wait, did you just... Did I accidentally just spam my defense drones into there? Is this what happened? Did, did I seriously just spam my defense drones into the fucking... Oh, fuck's sake. 
Don't believe it did that. Right, now don't mind me while I just uh, pillage pretty much all your worth. Is there anything else useful here? Ooh, standard ammo. Um, I'm not really interested in this iron ore because that's not really worth it. Do you know, it's actually a very small amount of standard ammo. I will, how uh, wait, no, that's carbon. I don't want carbon. Uh, we'll take the iron. Uh, screw it, we'll take the shells as well. Why the fuck not? We'll pick up that. And we'll also pick up that. And then... What have we got over here? Uh, ooh, deuterium. Deuterium, anyone? Do your deuterium. Ooh, there's, there's actually hydrogen here. Right. Let us teleport back and then we'll come back over. I'm just going to quickly go and dump this back onto my ship. Also, I realized that I picked up aluminium ore, not actual aluminium, but it's fine. I do not mind this fact. Right, that's one full. And then we just dump that down there. And then we go back over here and time to pillage all your worth yet again. Because, my god, did you have a lot of worth? I mean, I probably could have got away with not picking up the um, standard shells, but you know what's fine, fuck it. What have we got? We got carbon scrap, we've got silicon or carbon. S I don't understand how you can have carbon scrap, but. Kit. We'll pick up the rest of that nitrogen. Oh, actually, that's a lot of deuterium. Oh, that is a nice amount of deuterium. I like it indeed. I will definitely take that. Most definitely take that. We're going to pick up that as well. Oh, it's a beacon. Those are kind of rare. I mean, they're not exactly a great lot of use, but... Oh, fuck. Well, looks like I'm coming back over here another time, because one, I need to pick up the rest of that shit, and two, I need to actually get myself another mission. In the meantime, let's just go drop all of this back off at the ship. Get in my cargo hold. No, not you. I don't want you. Uh, oh, fuck. Right, fuck off. There we go. And that one. And then that one. And then that one. That one. That one. And we'll drop the last two there. Actually, going to have to be careful as to how much more I take on board because we're almost at a full hold here. Eesh. Eesh. Also, I just realized my fuel capacity is really fucking low. Like, really low. I think I said I had like 3,000, which is uh, not happy days for me at all. Not in the slightest. Uh, carbon scrap. Oh, shit, no. It was this side, wasn't it? Was it this side? Or was it that side? Or was it this side? Oh no, here we go. Here it is. The silicon ore and the zinc ore. Zinc. An important thing for just about fucking everything. Uh, though those missions are a pile of shit. Basically, that is how things go. So, we are going to go back. Uh, we're going to attempt to try and fire the ship, and it's uh, almost zero fuel capacity back towards the industrial complex. As to exactly how successful this is, I have no goddamn clue. 
Uh, right. Oh, I'll find the damn industrial complex first. Refinery station, supply depot. Ooh. Oh, wait, no, the supply depot is where it was. There's a weapon production. That's refinery station. This is a trade sphere. That's industrial. Ah, here we go. Industrial complex is this one. It's literally directly above my head. God damn it, on the other side of the fucking planet. Why? Why all the time with the other side of the planet? Um, that was infinitely less dramatic than I was hoping it would be. Um, set target to the industrial complex. Take a slow curve around the planet. Dee, 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 dee. I'm floating towards the space station. I'm going to try not to crash into it. Preferably not kill everyone aboard and myself and my ship. There we go. Yeah, it's a little bit faster. Holy crap nuggets, okay, very nearly missed that. Also, I just realized I have zero carry speed. Oh, no way. Probably not the best situation to be in, but it's fine. Let's fly towards it now, because I know there's screw nearby. Or at least somewhere there is. At least I'm pretty sure there's screw nearby somewhere. I'm not 100% certain on this, though. And then, in the moment now, we will fly into this asteroid field that is absolutely littered with water asteroids, which is very good for me. Can we stop? Thank you. Right. Now, I have to unload all of this shit, which is somewhat problematic. At least now we're actually at a stage that our main station, so it's not too much of a problem. I would infinitely prefer if we didn't have to do it like this, but it's fine. Uh, that one. And. Oh. Right, so I don't want to dump this into the personal. I want to dump this into the crew. Give this all to the crew vault. There we go. We're actually amassing a decent amount of crap here. Uh, the amount of just random bollocks that we have is ridiculous, frankly. Although, when I actually get the ages built, I'm definitely definitely keeping our defense drones on board I door did not want you to close there I was sorting out my damn bracelets god damn it door why are you doing this to me right give me that give me that give me that 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 and that wait how did I manage this in like two fucking trips yet carting it actually over here I did three trips I did that immensely wrong if that's how never mind I'm not even going to try and brain on my brain for that Why am I always facing the wrong fucking direction? Right, crew. Have. There we go. Right, so how many defense drones do we even have? I know we have defense drones. We have two. See, so, yeah, we have two defense drones and two repair drones. So I did accidentally spam those defense drones into the fucking thing. Shit. 
That was not sensible. Oh well. Anyway. Ship. I have a request for you. I need you to go into storage temporarily. So that you're hopefully not going to be burning a metric crap ton of fucking ship, basically. Not sure where I was going with that sentence, but yeah, basically, I d while it's in storage, it won't be burning that fuel off, and I need to go and get some more fuel for the ship, which, since I am too poor to buy fuel, we're going to have to do it the old-fashioned way, which unfortunately means that we need to refine a whole bunch of water. But it's fine, because doing it like this, I mean, that's already, what, about 5k, that's probably, what, 6, maybe 7k. Actually, combined with the um, amount of fuel that we have already, that may very well even be more fuel than that ship can even hold. It is entirely possible. Right, you're done. So let's pick you up. What are you doing? You're mine. You're probably mining the last little bit. Give me mine. Give. Ha ha! I beat you to it, Mr. Crane. Right. Let me just uh, splurge that into there. Yeah, seven seven thousand twenty-four. Combine that with the three things. Yeah, so that's actually ever so slightly more than what the ship can even hold. So we got a full full tank, and I didn't even really have to do a whole great deal apart from now I just have to wait here for a goddamn bazillion years whilst um, Why did this make a random noise? Fuck. Anyway, I just gotta wait for a hundred years while this does a thing. And then, with any luck. God damn it, I'm out of my monster. Life sucks. Give. Thank you. That's what, two, so we got another crate and a bit to go. Crate, if you would please. Any time this year. Any time at all. Aha! Thank you. Right, how much more have we got? Oh, yeah, not a lot at all. Uh, four hundred, three, two. And then splurge. There we go. Give. Giveth to me everything. Right, I'm going to go and get my chip back out of uh, storage. And I'm going to go and splurge this into its fuel tank. So you. Get out of storage, you lazy bum. Uh, that one. And then... Hit. There we go. And... Let me just go and... Splurge, splurge. Eh. Oh, shit. There we go. Oh, okay. So it's actually just under the amount of... Can... How much carbon have we accumulated? Not a lot at all. Well, I suppose you can't really expect much, considering that, you know, it's just me on board, so, yeah. Which reminds me, I actually may need to make an update to the Aegis, because if some things happen that I think are probably going to happen, then that ship's going to need a bigger oxygen supply. Because otherwise, it's going to evaporate in no time at all. Or, at the very least, we're going to have to carry more oxygen on board than I do in these videos, which I actually just kind of play into what I do normally, where I, I almost always keep, 
like when I'm just playing this on my own, I almost always keep at least one or two crates of oxygen on board. Just to be on the safe side. In fact, actually a rather large amount of my ships actually you uh, have a cargo pad in the life support room which is entirely for um, oxygen and this was before they included the two and one blocks uh, actually I need to make I need to see if the Aegis has even got that because I don't think it has I'm not 100% certain on that though uh, life support, which is deck two. Oh no, it does. It actually does have a uh, cut. Yeah, almost all of my life support rooms are very similar to this, where they have the life support machine, a console or something, and then a uh, cargo pad. If I've got two life support machines, then I'll have two cargo pads. But that's usually only for the bigger ships. Also, why did I change the design like halfway around? Hmm. I appreciate this room having the music though. Oh yeah, it's a completely pointless room. Like literally, the only reason this room even exists is because I needed to balance it up. So it's the night room. You can store items and, and weapons. Or, if you really wish, alternatively, you can actually retrofit, you can clean this room out, retrofit it to be another life support. So, yeah, th this room's actually retro, you can retrofit this room, because otherwise it, it, all it is is an item storage. Uh, then you got, what, engines? Because I realised, like, I'm doing this now, because I realised last time I didn't really actually show anyone around the ship properly. But you've got the engine room, which is pretty much all it says on the tin. It's the engines. That's it. Normally, I'd have a natural uh, entire engineering bay, but no, nah, this one doesn't. It actually just has an engine room, which is for batteries and shit, basically. Although, do I actually have any of those big 1000 batteries on here? I don't actually know. Oh, yeah, then we got the. Um, Twin deck, you've got the cargo storage and the actual mining bay, which has a few extra generators in it. Uh, down here in the welcome room, you have toilets, you have the kitchen. Again, these could be retrofitted if you really wished, but they are actually part of the main hall sequence, which is this. It's kind of like a little area in which people can be when they teleport aboard and you know it's a nice little guest area no I don't huh curious I actually thought I would have put uh, those on that that's interesting hmm. maybe I should maybe I should swap out like two of those batteries anyway back to the bridge to the bridge uh, yeah that that that's Pretty much the bridge. Nothing too special, apart from the fact that it's actually a multi-layered bridge. Yeah. Um, also, I kind of realised, like as I like towards the end, that uh, I'd completely forgotten to put this on the fucking cargo room, and I built the wing, one of the wings on this like. Uh, where is the cargo? Mining cargo. Yeah. Basically, this entire wall here is actually pretty much taken up by one of the wing sections on the outer hole. So I was like, ah, well, shit. That didn't, I didn't think that through. But anyway, let's uh, make a quick little change. So what do we want? We want engines. Which of these bad boys is responsible for engines? Just you. And then, oh, okay, so I can take out, what, maybe this one and this one. Um, or maybe even just take, I could probably even just afford to take out, like, the one. Yeah, let's do that. Let's, um, engines. 
let's go to devices and systems and I want to take this one here out and I want to swap you up for one of those there you go I also appreciate greatly that it matches to the rest of the color of the room that is a nice little addition and then you're automatically hooked to the engines aren't you yep there we go now I've got one of those big old batteries for the engines. I, I don't know why I put that on, to be honest, because it's got one of the capacitors, so it's not really necessary, but YOLO. I, want, I wanted one on there that those batteries are literally sitting there doing jack shit. Like, as you can see, anything that's powered, I mean, the, they, there's even a generator that's literally powering the lights, which isn't even necessary. There's even a few solar panels left over. Like when I was building the um, energy supply for this, I actually created the energy supply, and apparently the energy supply is less than what the ship even actually needs, which is interesting. I mean, that's not in exactly how I planned it to be. I did not intend for that to happen. Wait. Are you really part of the ship systems? Oh, so you are. Obviously, the life support and doors always linked up and hooked up together because I nearly always put at least one. I think I have at least one generator on life support and doors somewhere. Yeah, it's got like two batteries. And yeah, there you go. It's got a little hydrogen generator on its own, but it actually has. Uh, the life support and doors, because they take up such an inordinate amount, like they take up barely anything, so I just, I almost always power them by solar panels. And that generator is literally there for the sole purpose in case these decide that they don't want to work, and that's it. So you could probably even get away of actually switching that out and adding it on, but this ship has a lot of interchangeability into it. I actually built it in specifically so that it could be modified if necessary. Not hugely modified, but little bits here and there, if they need to be changed, they can be changed. Anyway, that's enough of me um, talking about that. I need to make sure that I actually save this though. Also, I need to see what kind of a dent that actually made into the current requirements to build it, because... I know roughly how much we needed. Uh, build that, and I want you to pull from the crew. Oh, actually, it dropped the uh, iron amount slightly. Oh, that's interesting. That's very interesting that it actually dropped the... Wait, why did it drop the iron amount? That can't be right. Did it drop the iron amount? Or am I just imagining things? I must be just, I'm, I'm going mad. It's fine. I've got the space crazies. It's just, it's because I'm always here on my own. And the fucking door won't open for me. And everything hates me. And wants to kill me all the time in space. But it's fine. Because I keep surviving anyway. And, you know, as the song goes, I will survive! And stuff. And I can't actually even remember the lyrics for that song. So I was going to sing it, but I'm not now. Because I can't remember the fucking lyrics. Fine. Anyway, I'm going to leave this video here, so thank you for watching. If you like this video, hit that like button, stay awesome as always, and I will see you lot in the next video.